evening, I'm Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and we welcome you to the MGM Grand here on the Vegas Strip in beautiful Las Vegas, Nevada. Our main event should be a good one tonight. This should be a really good matchup here tonight. All that energy that we saw it almost boiled over at the weigh-in yesterday. Now it gets to explode here in the ring. Sugar Ray Robinson's coming to the ring with his entourage of cornermen. But they look calm, cool, and collected. Hard to believe that they're going to be firing off punches within moments. Joe Frazier's making that final walk that separates man and warrior, soon to be in battle there in the ring. Remember, guys, obey my commands at all times. Let's have a good, clean fight. Touch them up. Fifteen rounds scheduled here in this much-anticipated fight, and we are underway with round number one. A well-targeted hook to the head by Joe Frazier. Boy, sharp two-punch combination by Joe Frazier. Joe Frazier swinging and missing like he's at bat right there. That punch was nowhere near his opponent. Right to the body. Good looking uppercut that time. You buy a ticket to a Joe Frazier fight, you have grand expectations. Yeah, and you have expectations that you're not going to be going to get a hot dog or going to get a soda. You better sit in your seat, have your eyes glued, because he's coming out after that man. A headshot block. Oh, good exchange there. Robinson's landing a combination here. That's what he does when he's at his very best. He's committing to the work downstairs. He puts forth the right hand. And now he's targeting upstairs. Ray Robinson blocks that punch. Keep it up. Oh, that's good stuff. Firing right back with one of his own. Good work by Sugar Ray Robinson. Robinson's showing you that sublime skill right now with that two-punch combo. Halfway through this round here, not able to land the headshot. Flush right hand to the body. So many times you hear of an early round where they're just feeling each other out. No way. Not these guys. Straight to action. Well, if they can keep this up, they're both going to have headaches, but we're going to have a special one on our hands. Scores well to the head with the right hand. Sugar Ray Robinson's the kind of boxer that wants to do just that. Find the target, get the combination working, land both punches. A great train uppercut by Joe Frazier. A crushing power shot after blocking his opponent. Keep working his chance. Robinson's power is dynamic, truly dynamic. The kind of stuff that could end this fight early on. Yeah, it is, but there's a danger to that, too. If he doesn't land early on, if he doesn't have his way early on, maybe he gets discouraged. Good double jab by Joe Frazier. Sugar Ray Robinson's feeling the sting of that big uppercut. Last 10 seconds of this first round. Robinson's doing well here with that two-punch combination. Keep doing what you're doing. And 
end of the round here, a round that saw a lot of action, the kind of round that fans pay to be here to see. Well, these are TV-friendly fighters, and we figured that coming in. You gotta let your hands go. You have to. You have to be busy. This, this guy is beating the shit out of you. You have to throw... Here we go. Round two is underway. Robinson's putting his punches together now. That's a nice combination. Good job by Sugar Ray Robinson landing that big right. There's a taste of the sweet science. You see the skill he has in counterpunching. And you know what he's doing? He's taking his opponent's jab away. Robinson's coming up big here early on in the fight because he just showed his opponent, hey, listen, you got to be careful. I can counterpunch. There's no better way to slow down your opponent. You know, we know the other way you slow him down. You hit him right on the chin and you make him say, hey, I don't want to walk in. But when you make him miss and you counter, that slows him down too. Robinson's making for a tough target there. He gets away from that punch. He took a shot, but he gives one of his own. A left hand scores. Robinson's three-punch combination there is going to impress the judges. Hey, we know Ray Robinson's got all the skills and all the tools, but he needs to apply a different skill set now. One that lets him survive this round and hopefully get back into this fight. Well-timed counter shot, the overhand right after the block punch. Upper up, upper up! For a moment there, you thought Sugar Ray Robinson may be down and out. He never even went down. Uppercut. Halfway through round side number side. Move your head. He's showing what a skilled fighter he is with the counterpunch. Well, the old times used to say when you come in there, when you're in control in there, you can make him do what you want. He made him tie his shoelaces right there. Robinson's combination punching is working well here. They trade shots. He comes back with a right hand. He clearly came in with a strategy here tonight, Teddy, and so many times it's, hey, I'm going to bang that drum. Yeah, he is banging that drum. That drum happens to be the body, and he figures that he's going to try to move on him, so start doing it early on, and later on he's going to have a guy in front of him. Crashes home with a hook. He just missed that shot up top. Counters with a crushing blow to the head. Smoking Joe Frazier lands a big uppercut. Very nice work to the head. The right hand landed. Just 10 seconds to go in this round. Oh, what a nice right hand by Ray Robinson. Sugar Ray Robinson now in between rounds, able to reflect on the damage he just did to his opponent. He got to him. And here we remember that reflection. You know, we look at it, we forget about it. He doesn't forget about it. He will go right back to that weakness that he saw, and he will make sure that he exploits it this round. Okay. You're doing good. You're doing good. Keep it up, all right? Very good. Very good. Any more I'll you one. And round number three is underway. Robinson's going out there trying to prove that he's in a good spot. That what's happened in the last round is not lingering into this round. Frazier's defense did a good job there, able to avoid that punch. Well-placed hook there. And he's holding. Targets a counter overhand right. Frazier's on the bad end of a very impressive hook up top. And there he counters back against his opponent. 
There's that overhand right. What's your body kick? Sugar Ray body Robinson's shot. on the receiving end of a very good counter punch. You see how quickly he pulls the trigger on the hook after that block? Robinson's showing you what it takes to be the best in this business. Good, crisp combos. Sizzling hand speed we saw moments ago. Heck of a combination, but uh, pretty easy to get it off when you're that fast. Yeah, it is. And what it causes, too, is besides us saying, ooh, that we see those quick hands and the judges, you know, marking it down. Also, it makes the opponent keep his hands in his pocket. He's afraid to move his hands because the other guy's so much faster. Smoking Joe with a good solid left hand. Robinson's great by an uppercut. How about that four punch combination? Move in, Both move guys in. have a lot to be proud of with their performances in this round so far, and they still want to give more. What an encore in this final minute. If you were a kid, you would feel that you're on one of those rides at Space Mountain. I mean, it's just extraordinary. Really brought at that time a four-punch combination. And now just wasting everybody's time holding on. Head hunting never hurt, does it with the hook. Robinson's combination punching working out well there. He landed three solid shots. Tried the hook, didn't get it. Takes one, but gives one. Good work by Sugar Ray Robinson. Frazier's hit by a counter punch there. Great work offensively landing that combination by Joe Frazier. Relax! Relax! He's doing great! Keep the pressure on him! Keep... All right, breathe. Deep breath. Get some water. You good? You all right? Breathe for me. Good. Now listen, you threw a wide punch out there and he caught you. Tighten up your... Three rounds in the books. Robinson's in control. Teddy, he's up with a clean sweep on your scorecard. Yeah, and I like the way he's doing it. You know, he's making the guy come to him, he's making a miss, and he's scoring all the clean punches. Showing you some defense there with the block. the left hand upstairs fine fundamentals good counter punch effective work with that flush overhand right left to the body Frazier's in there clinching more now it seems Teddy is it me or do you think he's clinching more after being hurt earlier well I think I'm watching a movie where you know in those prison of war movies yes! where they give you sodium pentothal I think that's what the truth serum was called and he's telling me the truth right now yeah he is clinching more he's not right oh a nice two punch combo by Joe Frazier up top with the right hand Frazier's gonna think about the next time he throws a punch because he just got hit by a good solid counter. That's a well-placed counter shot. It was the overhand right after he blocked his opponent's effort. Double jab, double jab. What a nice combo by Joe Frazier. when he gets to the inside. Joe Frazier's got a little something coming back at him. A counterpunch score. Frazier so dangerous with that accuracy. A two-punch combination landing. Effective counterpunching. Blocks it away. Overhand right. And he 
he just holds on there. Blocks a shot and pulls the trigger. Well, that's exactly what you should be doing on the inside. If you want to punch and you need space, do what you have to do to get that space. He's pushing him around. A little head hunting with the right. Parries that punch intended for the head. Uppercut! You can see he's trying to score up top, but off the mark there. Oh. Frazier's damaged by a right oh, hand. No. Round is over. Joe and Teddy with you ringside. I just can't get over the lack of defense here. It's as if he wasn't taught any in the gym. Well, see, that's the key. And I can tell you he wasn't. Because those are things that you have to be taught before you get to the event. Either you know it or you don't know it. He doesn't know it. He's not learning it now. All right, listen. You need to create more counter. Okay? Slip his punch. Then throw it straight. Round number five has arrived. Frazier's got all eyes on him right now. Everybody wants to see how he'll react after being stunned in that last round. Robinson's doing what every trainer wants to see their fighter do. Land punches and bunches. The combination lands. Now, this is just beautiful to watch. Watch how he just links one to the next, Teddy. A beautiful sequence, almost like musical notes being played. Well, exactly. It's a he nice tune because it just follows. One, as you said, follows the other. Nice and smooth. Very accurate work with the hook there after fine, fine defense. right in the way of that hook to the head. Oh, that, that'll hurt. Comes right back at him with a left hand. See him holding on. Frazier's got something to think about now. He just threw a punch and had one coming right back at him. His opponent scored well with the counter. Now this can become a bore, and he's making a decision to do it as he ties up again. Solid hook. How about that exchange? Really on the mark with that overhand left. Sugar Ray Robinson's up on the scorecard. Here. He's got to be up on the scorecard, but he is getting really pushed here. Yeah, he is. You know, this is a development fight. This is a fight where you come out of it and you get better. That doesn't happen all the time. Sometimes you just get another W. He is learning. Committing to the combo now. Both land. Off target with that hook. Targets the hook after blocking that shot. Well, supposed to be fighting, but instead he's hugging. He's that head moving. Scores big with the hook to the head. Get off the road. Robinson's putting forth that hard work he did in training camp there, landing it. Oh. There it is. Teddy, he goes down, and he was on the outside where he doesn't like to be. Where he shouldn't be, and he paid a price. Joe Frazier going to try to get himself right back in this fight again after being knocked down. What great boxing sports. The count. What a big shot. This is going to take some guts to get up from this. Once again, he goes down. Just much too much for his opponent. Another knockout for him.